Planet Dolan. What stuffed animal took the concept of bare hands way too far? How many unsettling ways can people find to incorporate teeth into a plushie? From deformed creatures to a plushie that eats itself, here are 10 of the creepiest stuffed animals you'll ever see. Hi there, my name is Doopy and I'm here to tell you some really interesting things that you might not have heard before. Number 10, Two-Headed Cat. You can do some pretty weird stuff with stuffed animals and still get away with convincing people that it's cute. Nickelodeon had a show called Cat Dog about a weird tube of an animal that was a cat on one side and a dog on the other. And we all pretty much were okay with that. Somehow, a creature that has combined cat and dog is considerably less disturbing than a creature that is just two cats. Maybe it's the huge dead eyes that make it so unsettling, or maybe it's the teddy bear shape that's way too wide. Either way, it looks like a boss from a horror game. Number 9. Shoe Bear If you're an optimistic type of person, maybe you can convince yourself that somebody just shoved a teddy bear into a shoe and he, the bear, is treating it like a comfy little bed. Otherwise, you can believe what it looks more like, that the bear and the shoe are one entity, and that the bear has to constantly bear the weight of people stepping on him all day. You can believe whatever you like, but look at that silent, pained cry for help. You know the truth. Number 8. Bear Hands Oh, that's cute. It's like a pun. It's using its bear hands because the hands are also bears. That's a really cute and fun idea in theory. In practice, it still looks almost cute because all the bears are smiling. They look really happy to have been sewn onto their brothers, becoming appendages on an increasingly shapeless mass of bear creatures. It's fine. It sounds horrifying, but they're smiling, so it's fine. It's not like they had their mouths sewn that way so they'd be unable to scream in unending terror, right? Nah, it's probably fine. It's worth it for the pun. Number 7. Real Teeth it's well established that the best way to take a normal stuffed animal and make it one of the creepiest things ever is that all you need to do is add real looking teeth. There are plenty of examples of this, but this pink monstrosity is one of the best because those look like real teeth, but they're jagged and gross and also it has this drugged out look on its face. It's a look that says, I know where you live, but I'm not going to attack you there. I'm going to find you when you're out in public, somewhere when you least expect it. And then I'm going to drag you into the dark realm, or possibly the dentist. Number 6. Taxidermy Nightmare it's hard to say if this even counts as a stuffed animal. It looks more like some sort of animal was taken to a taxidermist and they decided to shove a creepy doll face inside the animal skin. Taxidermy is creepy enough as it is, it didn't need any help being more unsettling. But some poor lost soul found a way to do it regardless. Here's the result. Hope you all enjoy. Number 5. Eternal Suffering the really sad thing is, this teddy bear actually looks really soft and nice. You might even enjoy snuggling with it, but you won't because it's absolutely terrifying. It doesn't want your snuggles. All it wants is the sweet release of death. Or at least, that's what it looks like when you use an illustration from Dante's Inferno instead of a normal teddy bear face. Number 4. Stuffed Tooth Okay, so we've already established that adding teeth to a stuffed animal is a surefire way to make it super creepy. So how do we take that to the next level? What if the stuffed animal is the tooth? And then we give the stuffed tooth even more teeth. Presumably, if you continue this logic, those smaller teeth will also have faces, which means even more teeth. You can test this by rubbing the front of your teeth and seeing if they bite you. Let us know how that goes. Number three, koala face. There's nothing wrong with wearing some kind of animal mask. They can be cute and not creepy at all, especially if they're not weird horse head masks. But it might be a little too much to wear like an entire koala bear as a mask because now it just looks like you've shoved your entire head up a koala's ass and are now looking and breathing out holes you've cut in its stomach. 
and the koala's face is intact to just sit there and wonder how his life came to this. Number two, teeth in the wrong place. We're taking the teeth thing even further now. Because up to now, we've had teeth on stuffed animals, but at least it's been a part of an actual face. Even that weird stuffed tooth had an actual face, so at least the teeth were in the right place, technically. So what the hell is this then? Because it looks like somebody has added gums and teeth to the gaping asshole of a stuffed badger. Or maybe, is this the backside of that weird taxidermy baby from earlier? What kind of nightmare creature is that? Number one, teddy bear entrails. Some of these stuffed animals have been mildly unsettling, but maybe not actually nightmare fuel. But that's because they weren't bloodied, torn open, anatomically correct teddy bears. There's so much going on here. Somebody clearly put a lot of effort into it. It's not just the rib cage, it's the bloodthirsty mouth and the drool and... Wait, is it eating its own entrails? It looks like it's holding intestines from its own gut and shoving them in its mouth. <laughs> Check out the latest Dolan Card update, Nixiumville. A new character, heaps of new skins, a new power-up, new level, daily missions, and offline mode. Download from the Android or iOS app store and start racing today for free. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you soon.